Hey everybody, it's Anna. Welcome to the Thursday card in this week's tarot story. We have our fourth major arcana card for this week and it is temperance. So temperance is all about living in the balance between our two natures of being spirit and being physical. And to represent that, the angel has one foot on the land and one foot in the water. So she is embodying the balance between the two natures. And so this reminds us that we came on this planet to hold in tandem spirit and physicality in the same experience, the same human experience. And the reason we're doing that is we are a bridge between the worlds. So our job is to live inside of the reality of the physical world, even while we're channeling new possibility, new energy, and new healing via our divine selves. So we have, in order to make this work, we have to be at peace and in balance with both. We have to honor and and, uh, love all parts of ourselves. So this week we've been looking a lot at balance about the flow of our balanced energy why we get stuck what is getting in our way what's what are we afraid of what don't we accept about ourselves what are we rejecting about ourselves and solving those problems so that we can find our a way to live in creative flow as much as possible and so you know achieve our work here on the planet so this card is gives us a clue as to how we live in balance. We have to be loving and mindful of our physical realities. And that means agreeing that we live on the physical plane and there are limitations to that. Things are slower on the physical plane, they're denser. So, you know, we can't move as quickly as we would like. We don't heal as quickly as we would like. We don't make progress as quickly as we would like. Went from our spiritual perspective, because the spirit is, is just ether, right? So it moves very easily. Being physical means you have to be patient and gentle and loving because there is a frailty or a fragility to the physical body. And we need to be loving of that. But it also says we need to be mindful of our spiritual truth as well. And that is the need to constantly expand, to constantly question, to constantly ask what is next. So if we are trying to settle too much for the status quo or try to make peace or compromise with what already is, and we're sort of pushing down our instinct for growth, that would be us failing to understand and honor our spiritual nature. So you have to be able to do both. It's not an easy task, but that's what we're here to do. So, you know, it's about figuring out where we might be unbalanced in our attention and our love and our compassion and sorting that out because both of these natures need to work together if we're going to channel cool new stuff into the world. See you tomorrow for our final card. Bye.